This is it. The dock for Wortham. God. That whole village has gone to hell. Are you sure I can't take you someplace else? No. The winds tell me I am precisely where I should be. The town is this way, I presume? Aye. Follow the road and be on your guard. Unfortunate things happen to travelers in that forest. Your warning is appreciated, but unnecessary. I am what unfortunate things fear. Darkness. Get away from those villagers. Drawn where they do not belong. Yet you are too late. Wortham is dead. Secure the gate. Bring the offering. The gift of blood shall open our Lord's path. What's your purpose, stranger? Your mayor issued a call for assistance. I am here to provide it. What can I do to help? The mayor? Akarat blessed that man's soul. 
Those cultists you just cast through attacked the town and dragged our people towards the caves in the west. You here to aid us? Then help my men kill those bastards and bring back anyone who lives. Go! Please, hurry! We'll guard the gates with our lives. I promise you. villagers. The storm within you grows strong. Your allies defend the gates. I suggest Yourself. You're safe now. Still, we shouldn't linger. Can you walk? Ah, uh, yes, yes, I, I think so. Wait! One of the others had a portal scroll, but we couldn't reach it. There, there it is! Come, let's leave this miserable place forever. I didn't thank you properly, friend. I'm Corin, the village's blacksmith. If you need to improve your armor or weapons, please see me.
weep and despair. For the sin of your existence will be bled away. Remain calm, everyone. We are not bereft of hope yet. Ah, hello, friend. You've arrived at quite a difficult time. As you can plainly see, the townsfolk are ill at ease. But we should be safe enough here for the moment. My name is Deckard Cain. I'm a bit of a traveling scholar, one might say. Lyra here mentioned you saved Corin from the cultists before that sudden commotion in the square. Please, tell me everything. It seems dark forces have set their eyes upon Wortham. The cultist leader mentioned a Lord of Damnation said he was seeking some prize. And that face wreathed in flame could have only been his. Lord of damnation. Things are far worse than I imagined. The forces of hell are seeking a shard of the world stone, an artifact with the power to create entire realities. Five years ago, the demon lord Bale nearly brought all of humanity under his thrall using that stone. If the demons were to obtain even a shard of it, the result would be catastrophic. We cannot allow that to happen. Adventurer! Cain! The cultists are attacking the Western Gate! We need help holding them back! Stronghold there. Don't worry about the town. Go. Show those cultists no mercy.
The shard is ours, and the rite is nearly finished. The way will open. of the world stone there was a time when i might have saved my home but now it festers with corruption kane will know what to do with it
What you've accomplished is miraculous, my friend. To face such foes and live to tell the tale. Simply astounding. We were lucky I arrived in time. The cultists were summoning demons. Their leader called out to the Lord of Damnation, a demon named Skarn. Skarn? I have never heard of this name before. And as far as I know, there is no demon Lord of Damnation. Most troubling. Indeed. And there's the matter of what we do with the Shard. This sort of power does not belong in mortal hands. On that, we agree. You see, I did not come to Wortham by chance, my friend. A Herodric ritual allowed me to divine the location of several world stone shards. One was here in Wortham. The other lies somewhere in the nearby cemetery of Ashwold. I came here hoping to obtain the shards and destroy them, if possible, before calamity descends upon us all. Be not alarmed, my old friend, for these frail bones come to you with an urgent request. My apprentice, Lethus, through foul means acquired a shard of the World Stone. In her pursuit of power, she has brought ruin upon Ashwold. The dead rise from their graves, and the balance teeters on the brink of disruption. Much like I, you cannot have forgotten the significance of that stone, or the sacrifice it took to end its threat. So I beg of you to lend your aid, however you can. Darkness. I was banished from my homeland because I would not turn a blind eye to the plight of those beyond the Isles. And I will not now. You cannot spare one branch while the tree burns. From the depths of my heart, Thank you, friend. Before you leave, I have a few gifts for you. The first of which lies here on the altar. While it may be simple, a good map is of vital importance. It will surely aid you upon your travels. This is Sanctuary. To protect it, you must cross many lands where forgotten evils linger. Yet you must go without fear into the heart of the unknown. This burden falls to us. A chance to fight the darkness. To ensure our home survival. For a new evil covets the world stone's power. If a shard falls into hell's clutches, our world will burn. This portal scroll has been specially attuned. Once you have reclaimed the World Stone Shard from Ashwold, you can use that scroll to open a portal to Westmarch. There, we will find a means to destroy the shards forever. Very well. I will meet you as soon as I am able. Be cautious on your journey to Ashwold, my friend.
Be not fearless, for those without fear, within our hearts exists an ember of light. Zakarum feeds it, protects it. Through faith and obedience alone can one's inner light repel the darkness. my responsibility. I can help you with. Nothing else I can help you with. for your help, but my husband, he's still in danger. Our home is to the northwest. He's all alone with those bandits. Please don't worry about me. Help him. A thousand blessings upon you, friend. Ashwald's always had the occasional bandit. Uh, nothing like this, though. What luck brings you to my door? I have my reasons. It seems Ashwald has become overrun with the undead. 
Do you know anything about that? Aye. The whole guard's been fighting them for weeks. My son joined up at the Crypt of Honor Dead just this morning. If you find him, I'm certain he can tell you more. Scylla's tomb. The Queen's tomb was hidden. The dead deserve their rest. Wrong answer. The dead serve me. A fact you will learn soon enough. You. It's your turn. So I suggest you speak quickly. Where is the tomb? I don't know. None of us do. Only the Queen's handmaiden knew its location, I swear! Lethus, stop this! Your wanton disregard for life ends here! You will be brought to justice! So, how I tire of your jealous attempts to suppress my potential. Now, now with the power of the World Stone at my command, I will obtain true dominion over the dead. Your entire lethargic order will be swept away and replaced by one with the ambition to reshape this corrupt world. You are a relic, old man, and you are no longer needed. For your aid, adventurer. It appears I must go and teach my former student another painful lesson. The guard still lives, it seems. I leave him in your capable hands. The wisdom of generations, of course. Oh, what a day. Certainly didn't expect to get choked by some death mage when I left the stead this morning. That death mage isn't past killing for the information she seeks. And you just gave her a new target. Asilla's handmaiden is as good as dead unless you help me. Light, mercy. You're right. Wait, I know. Captain Asmir at Guard's Watch. He knows the maid. If you head there right away, there may still be time.
cleanse the world of your impurity. So, you're the one who took care of the undead at our gates. Thank you for that. It's been a while since any visitor's been able to walk through them. But I won't lie, we're in dire straits here. My men's weaponry won't survive another round like that one. Talk to Paulie, a blacksmith, and bring me what he's got finished. Then we can talk. What can I do for you? The job well done. Need something reforged? Let me guess. Asmir sent you. <laughs> he knows I can see him, yeah? Well, like I told the last guy, weapons take time to forge. I'm working as fast as I can, and that's fairly fast, all right? <sighs> I'm sorry. The stress is eating everyone alive. Here, I've got half the lot done. Just take them to the man. Hopefully, that will hold them for a little while longer. <laughs> hmm. Back to work, then. You're back. And with half the order, no less. Ah, I wish this were enough, but more and more these undead are rising, and my men are tired. Still, thank you. We will make do. Now, I'm certain you didn't come all this way to deliver me a bundle of swords. What brings you to Guard's Watch? I'm looking for Queen Asilla's former handmaiden. The girl's life is in grave danger. A handmaiden? Gods I didn't know. Her home isn't far, just up the trail from here beyond the graves. I'd join you if I could, but... Don't worry. I will find her on my own.
I didn't kill her, if that's what you're thinking. <laughs> of course you didn't. No, I recognize my old student's handiwork. The body's still warm, too. Mm. You may wish to stand back. Reanimation can be... unpredictable. Guide my voice to the soul of the recently slain. Return to us, child. We have one final task for you. No! No! Stop torturing me! I didn't do anything! I told you everything! <laughs> it's all right. No one can hurt you anymore. You are safe now. That woman... The one who hurt you. What did she want? She wanted the location of the Queen's tomb. I told her. I didn't want you. But... She made me. They buried the Queen in the old garden. Hid her tomb underneath. So no one would ever just have her rest. I failed her, Scylla. I failed my queen. <sighs> Poor girl. I'll stay here, ensure she's properly interred. You, however, need to get to that tomb. Do not let Lethus near the queen's body. What can I do for you? Most appreciated. What can I do for you? Job well done. Need something reforged? Job well done. What can I do for you? No? Well, good luck out there. What can I do for you? The job well done. What can I do for you? Hmm. Back to work then.
not yet. King Leoric.
little bit longer. Again, I assume you followed the surge of energy here as well. Lethys never did have the patience for subtlety. Come, we must find the source of this profane rite. At its apex, we will find my wayward apprentice. barrier. Quaint. Well, there are always three of these rituals. Go and put an end to the others. In the meantime, I'll go and keep Lethys occupied. For my sake, do try to be expedient.
I must wait. Out the darkness and purity remains. Greatest necromancer alive, Rathma himself will fear my name. And you, your suffering begins now. is drawing strength from the Skeleton King's essence. You must go inside and break the tether that connects them. And how would I do that? Kill Leoric. You'd be surprised how often that works. Lephis desires dominion over the undead. The power Diablo left within Leoric's blackened soul. Put his spirit to rest and the rift will go inert. Stand united.
I've been expecting you. Thrown lies somewhere in this haunted realm. It's time to put this wretched soul back to rest. An intrusion! I will deal with this! Shall remember this trespass. How the living for your treachery. The fractures. lies somewhere in this haunted realm. It's time to put this wretched soul back to rest.
I shall remember this trespass. How the living will suffer for your treachery. The fracture. Yes, reforge that which is broken in you. Throne lies somewhere in this haunted realm. It's time to put his wretched soul back to rest. On intrusion, I will deal with this. Uh, have we not suffered enough? longer. Remember this trespass. How the living will suffer for your treasure. The fractures. Yes. Reforge that which is broken in you.
Amethyst got away. <laughs> she was right. I couldn't do it. I couldn't kill her. But you... You can still catch her, if you're quick about it. You're wounded. Let me help you. No. If she escapes because of me, I won't be able to live with myself. Go! Wait. It is done, Lethus. You will never have Leoric's soul. You're right. I won't. Instead, allow me to demonstrate what this stone can do in the right hands. My hands! So, Lethys escaped then. She never was the type to put her life on the line. Escaped? Ah, I see. I sensed no soul within the witch. Her construct was far more convincing than my Zephyrs. I suppose having a chunk of the World Stone in its possession helped. I'm glad to see it safely in your hands. Yes, I know what that is. Although it's quite a bit smaller than the last time I saw it. <sighs> I will have to follow after her. Regardless, I must thank you for your aid, my friend. Blessings of Rathma upon your journey, wherever it may take you. One last thing. When you return to Cain, it would be wise to have him examine that weapon you found. He may not look it, but that old scholar always had a knack for identifying hidden potential. The wisdom of all this suffering over a single shard. Now, let's see if this scroll of Westmarch he gave me actually works.
Stranger, we're speaking with all new arrivals seeking asylum. Hmm. You don't look like one of these refugees from Ashwald. What brings you to Westmarch? I'm supposed to meet someone in the city. Hmm. Another tight-lipped adventurer. You're not the first to step through these gates on business. All right. Everything changed. Adventurer! Ha! Huh. I knew it had to be you. Been waiting a while for you to show. Charcy would have stayed, but you know, she's got business to run. I'm sorry, who is Charcy? How do you know me? Oh, forgive me. <laughs> I got a little overzealous there. Let's say we all have a mutual friend. A certain scholar who arrived before you did. Our friend asked us to greet you when you arrived. Listen. Chas is the one you want to speak with. Find her at the blacksmith, and she'll guide you further. Welcome to Westmarch, and good luck. the gold nothing interests you well if you've got the gold I've got the goods you there do you have any chance come now let's see that come back if you acquire something interesting <laughs>
Hey there. It's good to see you. A man on the bridge implied you could help me find Deckard Kane. Grand is not the word I would use, but I envy the ease with which these people seem to live. My purpose here is urgent. Can you direct me to Deckard Kane? All right. So the shard is already in someone's hands then. I see. Well, if we have time, there is another matter. Zul mentioned you might be able to help me with a weapon I found. He said it had hidden potential, whatever that meant. I'll have a look around. Legendary gems seem very useful. How would one go about acquiring them?
but my purpose is greater. My fate is mine to decide. Merwin's breath renews me. service, my friend.
Glad to be of service, my friend. Some hilts, have you? Well, you're in the right place. Honor is hard won, and...
spoiling for a fight, cub. More for me, then. my responsibility. Like the wind, I saw.
Timing is everything. the darkness and purity remains. I was told you might be able to point me toward those studying the Elder Rift, but I sense you know a great deal about it yourself. You've got a sharp eye, adventurer. The court mages have been testing out various crests of power for a while now. We've just been given permission to start selling them. Only to... From the look of you, I think we might be able to do business, friend. What do you say? The first crest's on me. We have an accord, then. Head over to the pedestal and place that crest into one of the recesses there. From what the mages tell me, that should activate the Elder Rift. Good luck in there.
expecting you. of generations courses through me. The high heavens, someone finally survived! <laughs> I knew you were the right one. It's, tell me, what was it like in there? Maze-like paths filled with horrors, and occasionally, something of value. It reminded me of the mists. Wait, did you say finally survived? Valuable things, huh? Oh, I like the sound of that. Business is going to be booming once rumor of ancient treasures starts to circle around the city. Here, you more than earned these, friend. Have a few more crests on the house. Who knows what you'll find in there next time, huh? Hells, if you find something nice enough, you might even be able to make some decent platinum at that market in Rackers Square to the south. Take a gander if you get the chance. 
It'll be worth your time, I promise you that.
the wind, I soar. Kill these two before anyone else shows up. Are you all right? Can you walk? Ooh. Oh, yes, I think I'm fine. Thanks to the both of you. I may need some help getting back to my shop, however. Akarat, bless the both of you. Adventurer, I don't think it's a good idea for me to carry these gems any longer. Please, take them to my workshop and, and let my apprentice know we'll be there soon.
Tarsi is bringing him here now. He asked me to guard these gems until he arrived. Oh, the ship. I will tell you all. Oh, I have. Oh, never. Hello. How can I help you today? Oh, I see. Well, please come again. The both of you. Ah. All right. Goodbye. What do you need, friend? I am great. Goodbye. man's daughter.
discarded clothing in another emaciated body. A blood trail. Please, don't be the girl. Someone help! Please! I can't open the door! Father? Uh, are you there? <laughs> Alyssa, stay where you are. I'll get you out. Who are you? Where is father? Yes, but remain alert. We are close to their den. My rogues and I will continue the pursuit. Huh? Stop her! Oh, cruel fate for once. I am but an exile. Seek. Let me see it out. Sadly. Commander, Lakri's force. Flavi, as for you, Outlander, it appears you consider. With pleasure. I will see you inside, Kasha. The enemy's den lies beyond the felled tree. Take caution. The Bloodsworn are not to be trifled with. The rogues were outnumbered, but fought well. I will finish their fight. I did not expect much kindness was left in these woods. Not since the blood sworn began their... You're welcome. So far, you're the only prisoner I've seen still alive. Why have they not killed you? They were torturing me. Wanted me to join their perverse cause. That scene you saw outside. They want to spread that corruption through the woods. A druid would sooner die than aid in such a thing. Kasha, you've missed the excitement. 
Lakri and her kin captured this druid. He's been injured. Yes, he's lost a lot of blood. Our friend here will not survive long without treatment. Someone will have to stay with him. I have gotten this far on my own. What's a little further? You outlanders seem to love surprising me. Fine. Very well. Go and deal with Lockery. Once the deed is done, meet us back at the camp. May the Great Eye watch over you. Mistress, I've done as you asked. The blood of every man, woman, and child in Blackstone runs through your veins. Yet it is not enough. I must be whole once more. Hasten your efforts, lest you lose my favor. has always belonged to her. She will ensure you remember those you have forgotten. Lockery escaped. I must tell Kasha at once. Kasha. Oh, she, uh, she left for the battle camp a while ago. Had a druid in tow. Bleeding everywhere, that one was. Hopefully the priestess can see through his wounds. Head east through the woods to find the camp, but be careful. Demons plague this forest. Fallen have grown much more aggressive as of late. Kosha asked me to wait for you. Uh, I'm glad you. You're welcome, Nian. Do you know where I can find the battle camp of the Sisterhood?
It's not far. Keep going down this road and you'll find Kosha inside the camp. Oh, and maybe you can kill a few more fallen on the way. That would really help us out. Returned. I trust you bring news of victory. An incomplete one. The Blood Swan were driven from the village, but Lakri escaped. I see. Still, you've done well. This was never truly your fight, Outlander. If I remember, you came to this land in search of Akara, yes? It is time the two of you met. Go to her, and show respect, hmm? She may be the High Priestess of the Sisters of the Sightless Eye, but she is also like a mother to me. Oh, and don't fret about Lockery. My robes and I will handle her. Salvaging. Thank you for the coin, friend. <laughs> How may my knowledge help? Have a safe journey, adventurer. Nothing? <laughs> Fair enough. 